Hi everybody. I am back out in the woods as you can see and uh, have some noisy neighbors. Uh, so I decided to run out here real quick and do another video for you guys. I'd hope to have a camping video going and to actually be out in the woods camping right now. However, we uh, we've been hit with about three, maybe four full days of rain and thunderstorms and I'm actually shooting this in a gap in the weather <laughs> that matched up with my free time this morning. Um, so we're just going to have a quick tromp in the woods, try not to get too wet, see what we can see, and yeah, nothing too, uh, nothing too dramatic today. Of course I said that last video and morels a plenty. Okay, so they say no plan survives contact with the enemy. Uh, that is fairly true, as in things never go as planned. Uh, we have had two or three days of constant rain. We had a really, really uh, rough thunderstorm roll through here. Maybe behind me you can see. No, well you can see the the creek's really full. That wasn't one of my concerns coming out here today. Um, and I knew we'd had some flooding. You see where I'm going with this? So uh, I'm going to turn the camera around. And uh, or actually, I don't. Yeah, we'll, I'll turn the camera around. I don't think we're going to go the way we had intended to go. So here's the trail. And uh, it's pretty slick. I also was looking forward to seeing what the rains had washed out of any of the smaller creek beds, but uh, what I had not counted on was, and as you can see, we got a nice deadfall here from the storm. What happens? Let's get over this. Road ends in water. <laughs> yeah. So, a little bit of a setback. I am, however, this whole lowlands is flooded. I've yeah, it's it goes all the way back. However, there is. <clears throat> we're going to look at this. Let's look at this. Always an option. Let's try this. We're going to keep going this way. I don't know how much further we're going to be able to go. Let's see. Let's not run off into the creek there. Oh, all right. Let's keep going. Oh, I just missed it, guys. Crap. That was a that was a pair of scarlet tanagers. Uh, but no, they took off. Oh, man. I just need to keep the camera rolling all the time. To heck with my battery. Oh, what's this in the middle of the creek here? Let's hurry before he darts off. Do you see him? Oh, there he is. Hey, buddy. I'm not going to hurt you. I'm not going to hurt you. Little box turtle. Look at him. Little dinged up shell there. He's old. Can I get an action shot of you, mister? I, I don't want to interrupt where he was wanting to go, so I'm going to go over here and encourage him to go the way he wanted to go. I don't want him to turn around on me. See his shell is oh there he goes. Just had to act a little mean at him. Action Jackson. <laughs> Good luck, buddy. Good roads.
there's an angle right there. I don't know if you can see it, but it's kind of angles up this way, flattens out, and then kind of drops off right here. And I was curious because we have, we do have Native American mounds. Uh, and I, this was way too close to the trail, but I was curious, so I came up here on this hill. I'm gonna pull out here. We're gonna see what kind of mess we can get into. As you can see, it's pretty steep. It's not too bad, it's a short, it's just a short jump. But it is slick and it is soggy. But I rolled up this way just to see what was up here on top. Oh, and. Whoa, tree help, help tree. <laughs> it'll increase it'll increase my views if I just buy it and go down this hill with this camera. Oh, comedy gold. I, you probably can't see on the video, but this leaf litter on the ground is not as compact as you would expect it to be after four days of rain. Matter of fact, there is a trail. You can probably see it. Right there. And it comes through something hiked up that way probably a deer and it almost looks like they bedded down here um, there's some may apples that are pinched off on the top may apple plant but let's go up that hill all right I'm all for it. just a little cool something to show you guys poking things with sticks since 1977 okay Oh, it's completely falling apart. That is not a morel, by the way. That is not edible, I don't think. Like I said, I don't know my morels, but I have a friend who is teaching me my morels, my mushrooms. I don't know my mushrooms, but I know morels. I know chanterelles. And that's about... Okay, that's weird. Right here. Look at this. Just sitting on the forest floor is a geode. <laughs> Okay, and a, a worm, yeah, see the little worm there, came out and pissed him off a little bit, yay worms, so I dropped it, there it is, that's cool, just right there, huh, I usually like to go along the lateral side of the hill, but this one went straight up, a couple of them did actually, All right, let's keep going up and up and up and up and up. The fun part will be going down. Idea of just how littered our area is with geodes. I am at the top of a uh, pretty high ridge now at this point. You can see the creek way down there. And uh, up here near the top, just a geode hanging out. <laughs> Just hanging out, you know, doing its thing. And up. <sighs> okay. What is that? Uh, oh, it's a tree. Tree's fallen over a long time ago. And, uh, open grave. Not an open grave. Not an open grave. But we're going to look in it anyway, because that's what we do. Kick right here on the dirt. Oh, cool. These things, literally. Hello! Oh. It's, a little... it's just a little toad. He hop in his way. See you, buddy. I'm going to show you what I see here. I want to do it. I'm just turning around, but uh, that way, that way. I don't know. Right here. There's a stone there. This whole area. Like there's a block here. It appears to be dug out. Let me turn the camera around. The camera really doesn't do it justice. Um, let's see if I can get it from this angle. And oh my gosh, the sun may actually try to come out. Unbelievable. It's a better angle. Maybe you've got a hillock here, another hillock here. This has been 
back out. I don't know. I don't, there's a, I think there's a field stone there. There's a field stone over there. This might have been, oh yeah, here we go. An old, like, root cellar maybe. It's all moss covered, but there's lots of rocks here. This is just, this right here, you can't see it, but it kind of digs out and it's like a, so, you can see these stones here. There's stones all through here. And that's pretty deep. Oh yeah, that goes a good six inches down into there. This looks like it's dug out, lined with stones. So maybe a little cabin? I don't know. But I'm gonna remember this and come back here just to poke around. I'm not gonna take anything, I'm just possible somebody lived up here. Maybe. Heck of a hike for water though. I have a spider All right. a little spider on my glasses or my hat or I didn't get it. Where are you? You guys probably can't. I am 90% sure these are turkey tails and uh, called so because of the coloration you can see here, the banding and the coloration. And you can make a tea out of these. It's supposed to be really good for you. It's just all over this log here. These are really fresh, like this spring. Sometimes you'll find these and they're really, uh, really beat up and old and crusty, but there's my hand for scale. A whole bunch of these guys right along through here. I am finding a lot of these come up. I do not think they're edible, but uh, they're gilled. And uh, oh, broke in a little too much there. But they're popping up. I've seen probably, somebody nibbled on one there. I've seen probably 10 of these now. Get out of the way. So I'll have to see if I can get that ID'd. There's quite a few around here. Like I said, I don't think they are pickable, but we'll find out. Down this ridge line that I came up, we came up over this side, so I'm kind of coming down the other side. And, uh, well, if squall, if squall root was edible or tasty, I would be in the money right now. It's everywhere. There's some right here. There's more sticking up through a leaf. More over here. Here's some more right here. But wait, there's more. All this squaw root could be yours for the low, low price of, well, what do you got? Here's another patch. All right. This is where the fun begins. Which, which way should I turn this? <laughs> should I turn it? Should I keep it this way or should I put it back on me? So if I bite it, we'll put it back on me. So there's the ridge, guys. We're going down. We came up this. Now we're going to go back down. Get that a little further. It's not too bad right here. Oh, looky, look. Oh my gosh. Number two. All right, he's gorgeous. Look at him. He's a little one. Can you see him? Let me zoom in. There he is. Oh, that's awesome. Hopefully he won't be too skittish. Okay. okay. Go around and get a better angle on him. He's just heading downhill, like all of us. <laughs> Look at the color on that leg. It helps if I put him on the camera. Look at that. Gorgeous. 
Actually, I'll let me get really close. Turtle number two. Very cool. I'm gonna let him. I'm gonna let him go. Let him have his day. And I'm gonna try and break my leg on this hill. Thanks, buddy. Just a mushroom kind of day. Look at these guys. And there's another patch right here. Oh, I don't want to disturb them. Look at these. Here's my finger for scale, how tiny they are. All right, back on the trail, and uh, the sun is trying to come out, but uh, it's actually gorgeous out here. But there is uh, about 20, maybe 10 minutes out. I couldn't quite tell on the radar. There's a big, thick band of storms coming. So it's all an illusion. Pretty now, messy later. Kind of like this video. <laughs> I have I have no idea what that means. Uh, the sun is still trying to come out, but again, there's a line of storms on its way, so I'm going to head out of here, wrap it up. Uh, more videos on its way. I am getting out in the woods next weekend uh, for at least a one-nighter, maybe a two-nighter. We'll see how my scheduling goes. And I thought I saw a snake. Um, be bringing you along with me for that. More vids to come. If you like this video, of course, hit the little like button, subscribe. It helps the channel. It helps what I'm doing here. And uh, see you. See you on the next one. Hope you had fun. Get out there if you can. It's good for you.